This is Sylvain Gagne. Right. I got it right. Wow. Perfect. Sylvain, you're with Lou. Lou, what what the heck is Lou? Well, Lou is a system uh, that transforms your gym in a huge interactive playground for kids. It's meant to have the kids to move, to learn, to interact, to collaborate, and to develop social emotional skills. So how, uh, why would I want to do that as opposed to just having a regular gym? Why, why would I well, want to do gym, that? Well, the gym, the gym, the school is a less technological space yeah, well, available. Yeah, that, that's true. And uh, there's a great, it's a great place to do cross, um, cross curriculum stuff. So you can train and you can learn. Kinesthetic learning is basically more efficient than static learning. Right. It's been proved. And we want the kids, you know, we're fighting obesity and, and inactivity, inactivity for kids. So when they they have the feeling that they're playing in something and they're close to an environment they know, they're close to the computer environment, they're close to uh, the, the environment they have when they are in, in front of their tablet, but they're where others, they have to collaborate, they have to work together, they have to move, and they don't realize that they're learning at the same time. But that's perfect. So uh, you, were, you were showing me some of how it's set up here, and uh, let's go back. Can we go back to that? There we go. So talk to me a little bit about what I'm seeing here. So so here you're seeing a gym that's where you have a full installation uh -huh. of a duo. So kids can play games uh, once against another, dodgeball, basketball, right. on, on a international internet. Um, I'm sorry. So you have these things up in the. What yeah. are what are these actually up here? They're projectors, well, I assume. Yeah. Yeah. There's um, sound systems and light systems. So it gives. Kind of like what we have up here, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. This gives an environment, an, in, uh, an environment, immersive environment. So you have a small version of it here. So you're you're projecting onto a wall. A regular wall in any gym. That Can it be work. the floor as well, or is it, it has no, to be the it wall? Has to be a wall. It has to be the wall. Okay. And uh, the lights and sound will react to what's going on and enhance the experience. And we have all sorts of activities. So you can bring up people to run and sweat a lot, and bring them back, and then meditate and relax and wow. get ready to go back in their classroom. So it, that's the span. And you you can do maths, you can do spelling, you can do all sorts of things in the curriculum. All our curriculum is based on the International Baccalaureate Program. The IB program, IB okay. Program, so it's easy to refer to. Um, we're in nine languages, so you can learn Spanish or German or Danish or... Because you're a Canadian company. You're not, you're not, you're not based in the United States. You're I'm from French Quebec. Speak French speaking Quebec. Okay. So bonjour les Américains. Bonjour, yeah. Bonjour. <laughs> and welcome to Lou. <laughs> That's right. So does Lou mean something in nope. French? It just means it, it goes it relates to lights, Lumen. Uh, okay. To Ludzik, which is fun. To uh, Lumens which is, which is the intensity of light. So essentially what you're doing is you're putting up a, a, a sound and projection system inside of a inside of a, a, a closed gym. space it could be a gym right. or it could be any any closed space i take yeah. it it could be a cafeteria for instance uh, uh and and the the system like also has some kind of something in it that that can determine like we're watching some people behind you now they're throwing balls and it can determine when the ball hits a certain yes spot it, yeah it's it's detection uh, camera detection, basically. So, is there? Do we have, we have things besides balls that we can do? Is there? Well, like... you can play with your hands on uh -huh. different games, or the young ones or the small ones can play with your hands. Uh, you can play different uh, format of balls, uh, softer ones for kids so they don't run everywhere, right? Or or plastic ones or volleyballs or things like that. So, things are, are can be moved around. Uh, it's a great tool for uh, a phys ed uh, teacher because it helps him to program his session and build in activities and have the kids to know where they're going. Well, actually, I was going to ask you that. So how how does this differ, you know, obviously the interactivity, but how does it differ? How does the curriculum differ from a typical phys ed program where the kids are just bouncing balls and, well, you know? Well, you can, you can uh, insert in the system different activities to have a warm-up session and then have 
specifics on, on different aspects of phys ed that they want to go through. You can have, we have an app to uh, teach kids how to eat, what's good to eat, what are proteins and things like that. So those are all elements that you have in the phys ed program. Right, so they're not all just trying to like hit a hit a spot on the wall. There's, no. uh, okay. And, and the, the thing is used as a big chrono. So what's interesting is the teacher programs a session. The, the child's know what's coming up, how long it's gonna take, what they have to do. It's really helpful, helpful to organize sessions and have the kids to be really concentrated. How many engaged. kids at a time can use this? Well, depending on what game you're, or what utility you're having, from from five to sixty. Five to sixty at a time. So, like, can it do multiple? Is it just one wall at a time, or well, multiple it walls? It separates, so you can play on teams, and play teams together, teams each against each other, teams with people who have different tasks because they have to collaborate. Right. So, uh, so. There's a lot of possibilities with the system, so the kids are engaged and, and having fun. So it's really interesting because I'm, I'm thinking back to the old uh, Microsoft Wii, you know, where they, you know you got in front of the TV and you were hitting a, a tennis racket, a virtual tennis racket kind of thing. So this is kind of like the next next next, next generation, yes, you know, absolutely. taking it big. Uh, steroids, Wii on steroids, yes, I guess. Yeah, and I guess uh, well, it's, it's similar to the Wii experience, but with group um, doing specific tasks. The teacher is going to be able to push their own content in it. So if you have quiz, quests, or whatever, you can push in your, your questions. You can timer. You can time your activities and, and different levels of activities, different uh, level of difficulties, different level of. Uh, um, so you can do it for SPED students, uh, students that may be like physically. Like there, yeah. you can't, uh, you know, yeah. maybe wheelchair bound or something like that. So, yeah, okay. Yeah. So could be for rehab, it could be for, can be used in different, different factors. That's awesome. So, if someone's interested in the Lou, yes. well, how do they find well, out about it? Dif uh, Besides coming to TCA <laughs> and uh, going depending to the Depending in your area, we have resellers all over the United States. Uh, you can come on our website at playlou.com or playloujim.com. Uh, and you will find all the information you need about programs, the, the device, the different configurations, different testimonials. Uh, we have a Lou Lab where teachers can meet and talk together about their, their experience. And we have an international competition every year that brings schools from different countries to compete once against another. Do you have uh, Do you have any schools in Texas right now that are using this? Yes, we have schools in Texas. We have. Uh, um, in, uh, in uh, Austin, we have one. We have in uh, different. I'll show you the map where we are. That's where we are everywhere in the United States for now. So we need to get some out here to El Paso because there's nobody in this whole area. This salesperson needs to really get on the ball here. So. Yeah, but the map is not up to date. Uh, a month ago, we sold to a Clint ISD. Ah, well, there we go. So they're going to install uh, this week, the next week. They install this week. He just came right into the video. He's, yeah, like, he's very good. He's, very, he's, <laughs> he's, uh, he's um, Vincent, and he, he can be directly in touch with the people who are interested in Lou. Louplay.com? Lou Jim? Lou Jim. Lou Jim. That's a French website. That's a French website. It's Play. 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 I know no French. My well, I know fromage. That's about it. So, <laughs> thanks for talking to us. It was a pleasure. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you for thank you for by. interrupting. That was very good. Thank you. It's nice. <laughs>